Welcome to WatchCard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Thursday's story is the latest updates on X-Keyscore, which comes from the newest node in leaks. You've probably heard of X-Keyscore before. It's a system the NSA uses to track data on the internet. Basically, they can intercept data from all kinds of internet connections using backbone routers, and they're storing that data for a period of time to allow analysts to do searches, presumably looking for criminal activity. Anyways, the latest post from The Intercept details some more interesting details about this controversial NSA system. Now often when we hear about the Snowden leaks, the government tells us they don't spy on US citizens and they still are mostly metadata, nothing important. However, the latest highlights from this X-Keyscore update shows that the NSA system actually tracks the entire packet sniff of data for three to five days. This means things like the full chat, the full email, the document, documents you sent, and all kinds of other sensitive information. It's not just metadata. The NSA has all the data for around three to five days. After that, they apparently store the metadata only for another 35 days or so. In any case, it's kind of concerning how much data they're sniffing on. This article also talks about how the NSA is not supposed to uh, spy on American citizens, but they're capturing the data on American networks. And it's really up to the analysts to, to not look at the American citizens' data. There's no actual technical mechanisms to stop the gathering of, of data coming from American citizens. In any case, I don't want to go into all the details, but if you're interested in this sort of Snowden leak, be sure to check out the Intercept article. There's not much practical tips for this other than if you're communicating on the internet, you might want to encrypt your connections and use HTTPS. By the way, you might have noticed I missed a video yesterday. Sorry about that. It's because I was updating my production software, so I just had some down time. Finally, tomorrow is a U.S. holiday because of the 4th of July weekend, so I won't post again till Monday. If you're in the U.S., I hope you enjoy the 4th of July holiday. Otherwise, thanks for watching.